What's up, Bargain family? Welcome to my floor. So today for you guys, I have a Michael's grab bag unboxing video. Um, I know it's going to be Easter stuff because Easter just passed. And usually when the holiday passes and whatever they didn't sell through, they stick it in these boxes for $4. Not every single Michael's has them. Just keep your eyes open. Um, usually it's going to be at the front near the register. To save yourself a trip, I recommend calling Michael's first and seeing if it has it rather than driving to your local Michael's and then they don't have any. And I got massive boxes. This is the smallest one that I purchased. And then these ones, they're all massive in length. I absolutely love unboxing these boxes. I feel like you always get your money's worth. Sometimes you run into boxes that are just the same thing over and over again, and that kind of sucks, but you still do get your money's worth. Lots of the stuff I end up donating um, either to the local like thrift store and lots of times to my sister. I told you guys this before, my sister works with children, so lots of times I'm able to give her like stickers that I get in these boxes. It just depends what it is. I can't give her absolutely everything because something she can't bring to the kids. So yeah, that's normally what I end up doing if I find things that I don't keep. So let's begin. I'm going to start off with the smaller box. I can kind of see through, you know, the whole, let's open this baby up. I got a box cutter. I'm fancy today instead of using my keys. First item that I got is just this wicker Easter basket and I know I will not have any use for this. The next thing I see though, okay so for my wedding the flower girls were carrying moss baskets and one of them I got at Michael's. The other one I ended up getting from Hobby Lobby and I put the moss on it and I see this. So if you're having a woodland wedding I highly recommend moss baskets this is cute and i'm definitely going to save this one for next year because of the carrots right here i won't get rid of it if it was just a moss basket like this maybe i could find somebody who could use it for their own wedding but because of that i'm definitely saving this what did this retail for this retailed for 30 dollars and then this retailed for um 20 dollars which i think is crazy for something like that and then I'm definitely going to keep these every single year when Easter comes around. I always find myself buying eggs and I tend to use them in my videos and that's why I buy them. So this first one right here, this kind of reminds me of the Dollar Tree eggs that they got in the six count. And then I got this one that has like pastel glittery eggs. Both of them retailed for $5 each. And that's uh, it in this box beside like a whole bunch of moss that I'm hoping doesn't get on the carpet. I don't feel like vacuuming. Oh, I, it's it's there already. I definitely got my four dollars worth in that box for sure. Even if you know you think Michaels is overpriced on some of their items, which they totally are. Like that was twenty bucks. At all of them being a dollar because I got four items, totally worth the money. Okay, let's move on to the good stuff, the big boxes. I expect there to be more inside of this box just because it's bigger or at least bigger items. Okay, so the first item I am super super excited about is this right here. I got a throw. Pillow, it's a little bunny. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And then he got a little like tail right there. This retails for $24. But I don't have to just use this for Easter. I could flip this over just like this and use it all year round, especially during spring and summertime uh, with this check pattern. I can go ahead and put that on the, the couch right there. Okay, moving on. I got another, okay, there's a bunch of things in this. I got another little basket this one retailed for oh it's uh, 15 dollars and then inside of it there is some easter grass some pink easter grass there is um some easter eggs it's plastic easter eggs they retailed for two dollars then i got this little easter egg box this retailed for a dollar fifty and then there is um this bunny trail rock so the only thing inside of this that i would keep is this right here it's five dollars retail price i can use that again this again i don't know if i can so i'll ask my sister if not i'll donate it to somebody else and then i got this jumbo nested eggs there's three gigantic eggs inside of this thing i got some window gel cleans these retail for four dollars and it says happy easter i'm going to donate that i don't really use these types of things then oh this one's cute i got this little like um bucket and it just has like a bunny with a little blue tail uh and this one retailed for three dollars and then the last thing i got inside of here is this sign this is be our guest it retailed for ten dollars i like this one and if i didn't i could always just use this to do something else to it but i do like this so i'm gonna save it um blue abu di abu die you guys remember out of the box out of the box it was on yes Ooh, what did i just knock over we're gonna go to the next box Okay, so in this box, I, oh, yes, 
Okay, yes, I see these things at Michael's every single year and I really, 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 really want to get them, but they're freaking expensive and they always sell out when they go on clearance. Yes, I got a sale. So this retails for $50. It'll go out like half off and it's $25 and then when it goes to 60%, I try to wait till it's 80%, but by then they sell out on me. I got a freaking scale. I'm so excited about this. It's a blue scale. It looks like it works. This is the coolest thing I've got in one of these boxes ever. There's a lot inside of this one. I am so excited about this. I got this basket. This one is actually my favorite out of the like more eastery looking baskets. This one was $15. And then I got, oh, I like this. I got this gigantic carrot. I'm going to keep this gigantic carrot. And honestly, I don't feel like carrots are only good for Easter um, to decorate with. If you have farmhouse decor, I feel like it could work with anything. See, I can stick that big old carrot back there. And then I got, okay, let's here. I got this pillow. Okay, I like this pillow and all. I hit jackpot. I hit jackpot. This pillow was hiding another scale. I got a freaking uh, another scale. This one retails for $50. I think it's, it's the exact same thing, except this one is white. I am so happy. I am such a loser. I'm gonna stick it down here. Does this fit right here? Oh no. I'm gonna put this over here. This is like perfect. I told you it's perfect for farmhouse decor. Do this. I need something. I got like, there you go. Cute. I am so excited. This is like the most luck I've ever had with one of these things and just like the best items I've ever gotten. I'm so happy with that. And then, like I said, I got a pillow, but I saw the scale and the scale I'm really excited about. So this pillow says, show me the bunny. Oh, this is a cute pillow. Uh, I think I would just put this away. I'm definitely going to keep it. I don't have Easter pillows, so I will keep it. Um, this one was $24. The next item that I got is a burlap bow. This retailed for $10. I could use this anytime. Then I got more um, Easter eggs. Uh, I got some of these like the stuff you decorate eggs with but it's emoji eggs. Okay and then I got oh yes more Easter eggs but this time around they've got like a pearl finish to them. These retailed for five dollars. I really really like those and then I got another one of these little buckets but this time around the tail is a pink tail. What else did I get? I got this egg. Is this a glass egg? <coughs> oh sorry it is tabletop decor it looks like a dragon egg to me for some reason and this retailed for six dollars so i'm gonna keep that as well um and then i got some ribbon inside of here it's yellow ribbon and that's it for this box definitely worth the four dollars like i got my money's worth in that inside of that box so, like definitely even at four dollars that would be like crazy tough if i were just to spend four dollars on something like this so I'm happy. Let's move on to the next box. In the next box, I can see a basket right at the top. It's like kind of protruding. Okay, so next up, I got another throw pillow. This one I like a lot. This one is so, so cute. This one was $24. This reminds me of the decor that Dollar Tree had. Um, just that like wall art decor where the bunnies look just like this. And then I got, these are my favorite eggs I've seen so far. So it is just like pastel color eggs with little gold flecks. And this was $5. Then I got this little basket. I got another basket, but this basket I would keep. And there is some uh, grass attached to it. So it is just this wire basket. It includes a... Uh, excelsior and gift tag so i think that's why that's attached like this but this definitely you know i don't have to just use it during easter time i can actually use this as a fruit basket if i wanted to i got this easter little like tray thing definitely does not have to be used during just easter time this is perfect like rustic farmhouse decor to me with you know the galvanized look to it this was $30 you can even use this in the summertime you know just put like I don't know paper towels or dollies on top of this and then you can put like fruits on it or crackers whatever you want so yeah I'm keeping that like I said every single year I buy uh, Easter eggs and this is kind of funny because this time around when I went to Michael's these were the exact Easter eggs that I purchased it's um again pastel colors but with a matte finish to them this one has little like 
freckle looking things on it specks on it and then this one is just straight up matte nothing on it and both of them retailed for five dollars i'm still keeping all of the eggs all of the eggs you can do so much with these you know you can get like one of the dollar store wreaths and glue them around and make a really cute wreath that way you can use it during summertime um with the little like cartons that dollar tree had for you know your decor okay we're down to the final box i have so much stuff everywhere there was a lot in these boxes and what's crazy is the um walg oh not walgreens um, my why was i gonna say walgreens i don't even go to walgreens barely it's overpriced there but anyways michaels the michaels i went to they had a lot of boxes left oh yay oh he is so cute okay i sound crazy okay before i take him out i got another one of those wire baskets i would keep this one again doesn't have to be used only during um easter time and this was 20 bucks but the reason i'm saying he's so cute look what i got he is adorable and he has a bunch of eggs attached to him i got this little rabbit that is riding a, a um bicycle i wonder if he disattaches easily because you know you could just use this part all year round so this bunny he retailed for $30 I'm really happy with that I got more Easter eggs a lot more Easter eggs Easter eggs you guys have seen already and then I got um, some glitter Easter eggs I got more yellow ribbon but it's slightly different than the one that I got before and this one retailed for $4 and then the final items that I see is another one of those like gigantic egg things but this time around it has like those little specks all over it and it's just like a slightly different pink and then I got another basket but this one's probably like one of the bigger ones I've gotten okay now I need to get a calculator and add all this stuff together but I know I got my money's worth even if I were to buy this stuff all on sale or all on clearance even at the 80% off which is the final like clearance they mark it down to before they stick it in these things I know I got my money's worth. Y'all, I made serious bank on this. So I spent $20 on all the boxes, $4 each. I bought five of them. I added up all the retail price for this stuff, and at, that came out to $518.50. And even if I bought this all at the 50% off, that would have been $259.25. And then, I mean, even if it was at the clearance price where it went down to the cheapest it gets at 80 percent i still made out like a bandit i am so excited with some of the pieces that i bought the only thing is trying to figure out how to store this for next year some of these items but um most of it i'm giving away let me know what your favorite item was that i got down in the comments below i feel like a lot of you guys are gonna like the scale or maybe not maybe i'm the only person excited about a scale well, thank you so much for watching this Michael Grab Bag video. I appreciate you watching. Oh, and my graphic t-shirt real quick. It's actually from my parents. My dad texted me. He's like, what size do you wear a men's shirt? I was like, small. And then he got me this shirt. It says Nickelodeon University. Anyhow, again, thank you for watching. I will see you guys next time. Take care, bye.